we just met, so I don't want to do anything dramatic. I got you. I'm glad you're helping me out. Yeah, I, we, we, we have to get to know each other, right? Yes. Dika's here today. Hi, Dika. Hi. How are you doing? I'm fine. She had a cerebral palsy when you were younger, right? I you're still there. Yeah, you, you still do, right? But you, you, you've had it since you were young, right? I was born with it. Right, and then you had some surgeries done yes. here. Yes. But as you can see, it's really flat, and she's not walking normally putting extra pressure on these areas see the nails so i'm yeah, just gonna... you see my in between my toes they, they that big toe lays on that one on this one like that huh yeah yeah that may have to be fixed too yeah, yeah. it's all squashed in there huh yeah it's on top of that that one so we'll clean out all the nails today we took x-rays and it showed these bones are fused now you had surgeries done so i don't know what we can do to fix that but we, we will discuss further as to how we can uh, allow her to walk better maybe some braces uh, maybe some simple surgeries to make it make it feel better you know so so how how old were you when you were diagnosed with the uh, cerebral palsy uh i don't know that's what i usually i've been to people before but it might be sort of because i was born like i said born with cerebral palsy uh -huh. i was like a pound and a half Oh, you were born with it? Yes. Oh, I see. I uh, was in an incubator. Oh. They didn't know if I was going to live. Oh, you're a small baby, huh? Yeah, they didn't know if I was going to live. Oh, really? Wow. But you see up here, so yeah. You, you've been here. <laughs> so how are you getting around right now? I'm using a walker. Walker, okay. So um, you always been in a walker? No, I think the extra weight that I put on kind of ag aggravates the situation. Yeah. But I used to, to walk when I was younger. But that, younger like a kid well i had braces when i was a kid uh, -huh. uh if i remember taking pictures i see pictures i was in a special ed at uh -huh. first and i have a i see the picture would be standing up uh -huh. in class uh -huh. but i was inside something uh, like i said i had several surgeries where i've had class braces all right. and all that so wow. i've come a lot ways so you've been struggling with the walking and everything huh yeah, uh, the, last, the last surgery I had as an adult was in 09. Uh, 09? Yes. Uh, then before that, it was uh, 05. What? what it was, my knees. Because I, I started going to UCLA and they did the surgery. But what did they do for the knees? Uh, my knees at first were knocking. So what? then they did a major surgery. Uh -huh. And I had to ride it by the leg right there. Uh, oh, yeah, ride. Yeah, so the, the surgery they did in 05. So they got rid of the knee? No, knee joint? Well, they did something because now my knees don't hit when I walk. So. Oh, oh, I see. So they put a rod there? Yes. Wow. It, did it, still did it help? Me, it still let me down. Do what? It's still in me as we speak. Oh, really? They never took it out. Did they, have to, did they, they want to take it out? No, there was no discussion. Oh, really? Yeah. Did the surgery help? Yes. Oh, it did. Okay, good. But you still have the rod in there, and so make it really stiff then, right? I don't feel it. Oh, you don't feel it? Uh -uh. Can you move your knees? Uh, one knee, because I do go to physical therapy as well. Mm -hmm. So, um, one knee gets a little bit more than the other one. Mm -hmm. Because this one doesn't do that much when I walk. Mm -hmm. But my knees were knocking. That was what the surgery was for. Right, right. Uh, your, your feet are awfully flat, though. They're awfully flat, and I'm going to see if I can get some braces to get your feet underneath your ankle. And then see if that would help. If not, then we may have to entertain some surgeries here. But I don't want to jump in there right now. Okay? Okay. We just met, so I don't want to do anything dramatic. I got you. I'm glad you're helping me out. Yeah, I, we, we, we have to get to know each other, right? Yes. Before I do anything dramatic. Because I, I do have diabetes in my family. Should I be concerned about my nails being damaged and turning colors? Or is that part of the problem? Yes, well, you're not diabetic though, right? Well, I don't know about that. Okay. So, it was a discussion pre, but it was very little. Right, right. Yes, it could affect that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Send these nails uh, off to see if you have fungus, okay? 
I just figured I did that because they look the way they look. Yeah, it, it looks like fungus, but I, I've been surprised before. So we send it off and see, we'll confirm that it's fungus, and then we can do, do the treatments. Can the nails be repaired? Well, yes. Well, you're going to have to repair it. You, you do it yourself. I can only help you. But yes, it, 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 can, it can be helped. How do I repair it? Self-abate? Have people help me self-abate apple cider? Or? Yeah, you can be soaking and doing a lot of things too, but you, you have to get your internal organs clean. In other words, you have to change your diet. You have to change your the way you do things, you know? Okay. So, so you we'll, help you with that Yes, we'll do all of those things. I know it takes a lot of effort to do that, but that's what it takes to, um, you know, improve your nails. Because nails just not an external problem. It's an internal problem as well. Okay. Which is what most people don't know about. You need to improve your immune system okay. to heal the fungus problem. That they makes think, sense. Yeah, they think it's just, you know, uh, Taking some pills or and that's why I'm here. Like our sister, because I've been going to Dr. Doctor, I told you, uh -huh. she went from where she said, you know what, you need to go to a natural doctor, and, and you know, and she kind of said this, that she kind of said the same thing as was inside. Yeah. Uh -huh. this cow's a little bit. Yeah, we'll, we'll 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 be able to help you little by little. Not not that something drastic, but we're gonna make you comfortable, and then we we'll discuss more about the brace possibly, and then surgery after that. Okay. Yeah, it'll take some time to get things under control. I have to watch a walk. You know, there's there's a lot of things that are involved. Okay. Are you gonna watch me walk today before I leave? Yeah. Uh, yes. Okay. I already took your x-rays, so basically uh, they did surgery to fuse the joints to keep your foot straight apparently, but uh, I want to see how you're functioning right now, okay? Very good. Do you have an idea why this foot looks worse than that foot? Even though that's starting to turn too. Uh -huh. Why, why that is? Uh, yeah, I'm not sure right now yet. Let me evaluate your walking. Even this nail will take a little while to get this down to a pretty good uh, uh, thickness of the nail too. Okay. Because uh, if I do too much today, then you won't have you won't you'll have a lot of pain. So we we want to stay in good terms, right? Okay. So if I do pay, just take the car off? I'm sorry? Just take the car off when I get home? Uh, no, it's okay when, when you get home. Just right now. We, we, I don't want to do too much for you. Oh, you talking about that. Yeah. Right, right. So it's been hard for you to get around and everything, huh? All your life. Yeah. Just Can I make it a doctor? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You look like I, I hear your voice very pleasant and positive. And <clears throat> I would be able to get out of here. Exactly, right? <laughs> yeah. I hear you. And then you're also telling me about you're advocating for the disabled people, right? So tell us about that. Uh huh. Uh-huh. 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 Wow, you're an important person. Yeah. Uh, uh, I also... I didn't realize. the Disabled Rights California Board. Oh, wow. And uh, wow. Department of Development Services in Sacramento. Great. Well, wonderful. Keep up the good work. Let me take a quick picture of your both feet okay. right here together. Now that's how my feet supposed to be, right? Yeah. But then they don't come up, I guess because I'm fused. Yeah. I'm going to collect some of these samples. So when you're ready, just put your 
shoes back on and walk a little bit for me, okay? Okay, I'll try to get out to see the assistance. Okay.